Hey everyone, welcome back. Hey guys. All right, let's get back into the action. Since we already spent most of our uh, allotment for this month, let's just dive right in and start scanning for us some activity. How's that sound? How do we always have no money? Because we get a lot of money and then we spend it all on stuff we want. <laughs> See, I feel like this is not practical. See capitalism. No practical. Request from Japan. They want laser rifles. So does America. We don't have freaking laser rifles. No, we don't. I'm sorry, everybody. And we don't have the money to manufacture them, no, so you guys... No, we don't have the alloys to manufacture it. Yeah, so they can just wait. Uh-oh. Oh, okay, that we could do. A UFO is just up and landed in Australia. A large scout. Don't we have a satellite and interceptors and... Well, that's a thing. We do. But this one just up and plopped down on the ground. Well, yeah, but... We didn't even get a chance to intercept it. Oh, I guess uh, they just missed it. And then some farmer out in the field said, Hey, they're over there! And why do we need her? Oh, you're a colonel too. Cur these two are both colonels. Yeah. How about that guy? Yeah, there's that guy. Yeah, that guy. That guy. Alright, that, hey, there's that guy, there's that guy. Where's missionary? Missionary is... Uh, where is missionary? She, she was injured. I think she's wounded. I think she was. I don't think she still is. Um, then where is she? That doesn't make any sense. Corporal Jackson is our sniper. Yeah, but she's also... Missionary is... Well, she's there. She's just not on this mission. Yeah, I was gonna say. She must be out of Alaska. I told you she was ready. Okay. No, we need the sniper back. Alright, where's Donna? Yeah. Donna Jackson! Alright, so you've got a sniper, you're... let's see, we have two supports, like usual, assault heavy, sniper heavy. We actually have two heavies. Yeah, we are looking for another assault, but somebody else got injured or dead or something. Well, no, there's four classes, though, so we shouldn't have... we should only have one... well, no, there'd actually be two redundant, because if we had four, there'd be one redundant of another and one redundant of another. We usually go with two heavies. Actually, Colonel Bennett... Uh, Mr. Nice Guy is now actually also a colonel as well, meaning he can't rank up anymore. Okay. Which means we need to train some new people. No doubt about it. Yeah. Alright, so you get the normal stuff, because you're not going this time. Alright, sorry colonel, you get to, to you relax for a little bit. Yeah. So these three are all colonels, the top, Mr. Nice, Nyako, and Badass. Yeah. So, let's see, we could go with Missionary, another support. We could go we with the Carlos supports, Guzman, then. who's a little John. Wanna take out little John? Yeah. Alright, he's a lieutenant, so he's reasonably experienced. Let's give him all the fun stuff that we all know and love. Like heavy lasers and rocket launchers and... Not a problem. Well, we could oh, give him armor or alien grenades. No, do we still have somebody with the... I'm pretty sure we table do. Table lamp, I think, has it. Let's, let's find out. Yes, table lamp has the yeah. art thrower. And is also the guy who somehow is never actually injured. Yeah. Despite his best attempts to do so. So that's cool. Okay. Alright, well, I guess that'll work. Go, team, go! How did you get injured when you came Probably. It's true. Bodies are more relaxed. Mm -hmm. A pending request on behalf of the United States has expired. No. Sorry, we don't have laser guns. Yeah, there's the satellite. Yeah, right. We weren't even able to pick them up until they were like sitting up here and near. What is this? I have no idea. Do yeah. not ask me, Jennifer. I know Australia. Eastern Australia. Yeah. Whatever. Let's Sorry, go. guys. I fell at this. It's in. in no, it's places. just in Australia. You actually don't get a place name. Wow, Pistras never run out of ammunition. Set down in a sparsely populated area. We need to stay sharp and eliminate the invaders. That might be make for a funny playthrough. Only pistols. Yeah. And you research all the pistol technology. So if we get an easier mission, we can always try a <laughs> pistol mission. You just have to upgrade it for it to make any sense. Yeah. All right, set that big mother down. All right, team of four, let's run out because we couldn't bother to add a couple more people to this cutscene. Mm -hmm. Okay. At least I got the right character. That is true. That is a good point. Mm -hmm. All the aliens. Smart. 
all the aliens are probably going to be all alive and well and being like, hello, what are you doing here? Yeah. We're actually quite uncomfortable with your presence. Wow, we can already see the ship of all places. Let's go on Overwatch. Um, here's Mr. Table Lamp. He's going to go last because he's kind of the one who always makes great chaos happen. Mm -hmm. No matter where he is or what he does. Hey guys, look at this. Oh crap. Oh no. But somehow he still pulls it off. He's like badass, but funnier. Drunker. Drunker <laughs> and funnier. That's how he rolls. He doesn't do it intentionally. Badass is intentionally badass. Yeah. Table Lamp just kind of fumbles his way into badass situations. And still comes out on top. Yeah. Eh, that makes sense. Yeah. Alright. That guy, he's the other medic. And that guy, is that... Yeah, there apparently there used to be some cars here. Interesting. Because those are hubcap. Not hubcaps, those are wheel, um, wheel casings. And tires. And tires. Possibly the aliens are collecting it. Oh my goodness. The aliens are interested in American automotive technology. Oh, we have no idea what it's American. Human. Human automotive technology. We are in Australia. This has so. grave implications for everyone. All right, this is the closest we can go and still be in full cover. So go ahead, table lamp. See what you can run into with your face. <laughs> there we go. <laughs> well done, sir. Didn't we need their corpses for something anyway? Uh, for something. I don't remember what it is. Okay, apparently they just recognize it's their turn. Go, Guzman! Oh, I think it has something to do with the airplanes. Miss? You're, you're gonna upgrade the airplanes? Maybe that's what you need it for? I don't think it's that. Alright guys, apparently we are a little clueless on what we needed the main courses for. So if anybody remembers or just watched that video, can you let us know? <laughs> People are not gonna do that. All right, Gardner gets to take a shot. Pew, 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 and everybody misses. Sometimes people might watch a few episodes together, especially if they're away or something. That is true. Oh, uh, it looks like uh, poor old Table Lamp's already been poisoned. Nah. Nah, he'll be fine. Yeah, somehow he always finds a way to survive. Despite probably not... Really, uh -oh. it seems like he's not supposed to. Uh-oh. All right, we got the big guns here. Go, Jackson! Hit him with your lasers. Ribs. Slow motion. Oh. You miss. Damn it. I'm not sure how you missed. They were just kind of standing there. Well, that's because it's a slow motion shot. Mm. They were running, technically. Yeah. Uh oh. Oh boy. Oh, it's a big rigger. It's not carrying a weapon like the others. What could it be doing? Oh, you see him? Yeah. You know what he is? No. He's a berserker. Uh oh. He's got 20 health. And every time he gets hit, he starts charging towards whoever shot him. Oh, so the other and if he gets, away should hit him. And if he gets close enough, he takes those giant blades that are embedded into his fists and shoves them into your face. So then people far away should hit him. Yes, people very far away. However, we're kind of in a little bit of a pickle here. Yeah. Because, um... Well, well, he can hit a lot of people. Yeah, he's also highly exposed and also yeah. poisoned. Let's see what his chances are. 61%, 51%, 41, 35, 19, 25, 1%. All right, well, uh, let's see if he can pick off this thin man over here. It doesn't matter that he's staying inside the poison because he's already poisoned. It doesn't even yeah. really mean anything at this point. And it appears to give him a little bit of a... Okay, or something. Just because it obscures vision. Yeah. All right, it's like so. A smoke grenade. Kind of. All right, so we obviously need to bring the fire down on these suckers. Uh, this is actually a fantastic position, considering it offers cover from three different angles. And he actually has a decent shot at that guy down there. Get him! Wow. Nice. Good shot, uh, Jin. He's doing a happy dance. And we all know what it looks like. Oh, oh yeah. What is Jin? Gangnam. Gangnam yeah. style. That's what Gangnam style is, kids. Mm -hmm. Right there. Alright, well, we're going to have to come up with a hilarious way to bait this guy, because if we don't, he's going to get really hurt. Uh, run back. Run back there. Get away from that thing before he, he eats your brain. Alright, so we have a clear shot at him, and an even better shot at that one. I think we should probably focus on tons of fun here. Okay. Shoot him with your gun! Wow, seven damage. Good job. How far can he move? Quite a bit. 
See, he just, and his movement and reaction to being shot yeah. is a reaction. It doesn't count as his turn. Oh. But he has the disadvantage of that he has no ranged attack. Yeah. So it's basically a game of playing keep away. Because the other way, he will eat your face. Alright, well, we have a very close target here. Because she's a sniper, her odds actually get worse if they're closer. Yeah. Um, right now, she's in a somewhat exposed position. But it's worth it to try to take out these enemies before they throw grenades or whatnot. Go, Donna, go! Alright, two damage. Yeah, I wish you had them. Mm-hmm. She's contributing. The heavies. These are the guys who are going to be to mow this sucker down. And I think that's pretty much... Oh, those two are clumped together. Might be a good idea for a rocket, too. Oh, really? Yeah, those guys behind the wall. Oh, that's true, but if we shoot rockets to get at all these guys, yeah. it's going to create a situation where this guy is still running rampant. Right now, mm -hmm. Mr. Berserker Man is the bigger well, threat. Well, I think you should do one-on-one. -on -one. Uh, the rockets won't kill those guys down there. It'll only wound them. We need to take enemies out of the fight as quickly as we can. So we got seven damage on the Mr. Berserker here. That's 14 now. I have no idea how we're going to capture this thing alive. Mm -hmm. I mean, he needs to be below, like, uh, what, three health or lower in order to be able to reliably do that. Except, uh, yeah, he's, he's way too close for comfort, so we're just going to keep shooting him. Yeah, I think we're going to just shoot him. Oh, so man, shooting. that's that's unlucky. Luckily, Guzman is right here, and he's got a pretty clear shot at him as well. Yeah. Duck, buddy! Uh, okay, well, you're going to take gonna take your second shot and really hope this works. I'm really disappointed in you right now. Alright, three damage. Hey! He's actually down to three health. Oh, now it's going to see uh, who survives this guy. Oh boy. Well, luckily the heavies are the ones who are going to get stabbed. Yeah. And maybe they'll survive it. They're falling back. Really? Apparently they got flushed. Oh, not that good. Oh, well, looks like he got rushed. Yeah, you're going to get hit. Pew, pew! Four damage. That's, uh, uh Jim. Uh, Gangnam uh, Style. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Gangnam Style. Where's Table Man? Table Lamp is in the poison, and he's right. now suppressed. Which means he's not getting hit, but he'll get uh, opportunity shots at him if he tries to run. Yeah. It makes you less accurate as well. Alright, this guy is used to move action, so he's not attacking, but he's trying to flank. Oh. And we have floaters, but they're not that dangerous in terms of their no, damage. No, but output. it's just going to add more to the flanking. That is true. What we have to worry about is this guy. Who's he going to stab? He's going to go after Donna. Oh. But he didn't actually attack. I think he ran out of movement. Did he? That's weird. I could have swore that he had more stuff that he could do. Look out, Donna! Luckily, now her cover is not really very good anymore. Wow, amazingly enough, he actually didn't have enough movement to run up to her and stab her. Yeah. Alright. I don't know how this suppression fire is not hitting her, too. Wow, he actually has... I wonder if we can actually run and gun and tase him. Yeah. Let's try it. If we can't, we'll just shoot him in the face. Alright, here we go. Um, there really is very little good place to go, so we'll just run over there. He'll dodge it because he has lightning reflexes. It doesn't even matter. Yeah, first one. Well, I think that's the only one that's actually going to get a shot. I think he's facing the opposite direction. Yeah, that is and kind it's of... it's kind of like boomeranging around or something. That is kind of funny. Alright, where's tons of fun? Uh, okay, he's right in front of us. Yeah. Oh, are you saying we actually can't use it? Doesn't look like it. Damn, we're just gonna have to shoot him. Oh okay. well, sorry. Well, we'll get one next time. Yep. Sorry, scientist lady. Yeah. Deal with it. Our condolences. Alright, so now these two are bunched up in front of these guys, which is no good at all, because they might throw a grenade at us. Yay. So, um, Miss Sniper here needs to find better cover. Yeah, sure. Wait, maybe... Is that, is that, is that, that, would that work there? Um, yes, it would. Against these guys, yes, but not against the... the well, they're too, the far, they're too far away oh, okay. to really take a shot at her. Um, oh, I guess go on Overwatch because you don't have an active shot, maybe mm -hmm. if they move forward. This, however, is an opportunity that's too good not to take advantage of. Look at all these re who just ran into the area. Just going to fire a rocket right in front and mm -hmm. hopefully be able to get four of them. Okay, it's all you, Guzman. Let yeah. him have it. Little John! Boo! <laughs> Look at them fly. Nice. 
through the door and everything. Oh, it looks like we didn't hit the Thin Man. Oh, whatever. Whatever. We that got, was awesome anyway. We got three floaters. We have nothing to complain about right now. Yeah. All right. Uh, let's see. Who's next? All right. This guy. Uh, well, Gangnam Style, I'd say it's high time you defend yourself. I imagine you can How do that. How is this only 90% of them weren't right there? Because he was behind partial cover. I don't think he's poisoned. No, he's out of distance. Oh, good. Uh, let's see. We need another rocket in that. And where? Oh, they moved apart. Yes, they did. Oh, uh, he's, he's actually out of ammo. Yeah. Uh, I guess he'll just reload, because that's really more important. Yeah, it is. More ammo. Uh, as for our medic man... Well, medic he, can hit people. He can, but is it safe for him to move up? Here, he'll have... Hold on, I have to do it just right there. There we go. It's in his movement span. He's got cover. And now he can shoot at this guy. And actually have a decent shot. Because I am seven damage. Good job. Yeah, good one, Ricardo. Which one's Ricardo? Ricardo's that guy. Yeah, he's that guy. Mm-hmm. Oh, she's taking the opportunity shot. Get him, Jackson! He's a little close, though, so we'll see what happens. Zoom! She is, you mean. Fire nice. damage! I was talking about the guy. The well, alien guy. Mm -hmm. It's not like the penalties are that huge. I mean, it's still yeah. a high chance. It's just not as high. She's still got five damage. Yeah, that's great. All right, so one thin man running for his life. Yeah. All right, these two very weakened... Uh... Oh, now they are all bunched up again. Yeah, they are. Rocket dive. I think so. Ah, he's doing the blood call. That basically gives them all a buff. He's taking a shot at our heavy, and he's missing. And this actually seems like a perfect opportunity for another rocket attack. Mm -hmm. uh, you already fired one, so you just reload. Uh, actually, I'm talking to you, yeah, Moose. Alright, Moose. These guys are already pretty badly banged up, so use your shredder rocket instead of your normal rocket. Alright, this should hit all of them. Yeah, I think so. Go, Moose, go! Represent Canada for everyone! Woo! Oh, Canada! Nice. Alright, you can call them shredded. Okay, this one is wide open. Let's see, uh, Donna needs to get some target practice, so pick him off, Donna. And she needs to reload after that. And go for a headshot, just for fun. Why not? Bazoom! Two damage. Yeah, she hit him. I winched him right in the ear. Yeah. Alright, table lamp. We've already captured these things, haven't we? Yes. Yeah, I think we've captured mutons, but we haven't captured the berserkers. Yeah. So, I guess we'll save the charges. Um, hey, that guy. I guess it's all on you. Yeah, you can do it. Take a shot. Wow, one damage. Okay, well, you did hit. Yeah, it still counts. Nobody is going to blame you for that. Yeah. Uh, yeah, he's going to have accuracy issues unless he gets closer. So, let's him just do the thing he does, which is to move the edge of his movement arc. Hmm. And then just be like, oh, hi, I don't care if I'm exposed, because you're dead. Alright, and then there's this punk that was running away from us. Luckily, uh, gosh, is there a place we can move? Yeah, that one's okay. He might get poisoned as well. Oh, actually, he avoided it. Good for him. Nice job. Can he hit that guy? Reasonable chance. He danced around the poison. Two damage. Yeah, he did. He did the horse dance. It is the strangest thing. Mm -hmm. I love it. Yeah, it's fun. It's even in League of Legends. It it's everywhere. It's all over the world now. Mm -hmm. Table lamp continuing to get shot while being poisoned at the same time. Nice. As is his purview of things. All right, you can probably get him, huh? Yeah, I thought so. You may want to reload lasers before you head inside. Not a firepower over here. Okay. Yeah. So medic. Guess what? Your job is to make Table Lamp look less like... Furniture? <laughs> less, yeah, less like furniture. I guess that's what we're going to go with here. I, I don't know. That was terrible. I'm yeah, sorry. Yeah, yeah. Sorry, No everybody. idea. Maybe give him some polish. Some furniture polish. Hmm. Make him feel a little bit better about himself. Yeah. All right, little John's going to move up and guard the front. There are a bunch of people that need to reload, though, before you, like, enter the ship. Of course. 
All right, we'll just have, this place seems clear, so we'll just have Jackson move out in the open and reload her laser sniper rifle. Same thing for you, table lamp. Uh, let's see, you can move up here and go behind the uh, burning tree that apparently is still full cover. Yep. Well, it's still there. And go on overwatch just in case something appears. Weird, that one has a blue mist rather than a green mist. Yeah, it's kind of both. Mm, yeah, I suppose. All right, well, let's get ready to actually push inside this thing. I think it turns more green as it's... Oh, that might be possible. That might be what it does. Ooh, All right, so he opens the door, and there's actually nothing here. So he's fine where he is. All right, Donna, we're just going to have you run up to there. Just because it seems reasonable. People should at least operate in pairs, if not threes. Table lamp... Yeah, hey, you're okay. He's table lamp. He gets hurt. Yeah, he'll be fine. Yep. I'll drink it off. Mm-hmm. <laughs> nothing, nothing gets this guy down. I mean, we try. We we put him in danger, ridiculously dangerous maneuvers, and he still comes out on top. Because he's drunk. Because it's apparently so. Wow, Moose can actually move really far for being heavy. Oh, that's good. All right, Shin, um, move to the edge of your distance, and reload. let's see, he did get hit. He so he needs to both reload and heal himself. Healing comes first, because other people yeah. have firepower on hand. So make yourself all better, you'll reload next turn. That guy, that, that guy, guy needs to reload. Needs to so move up into cover, and reload your laser rifle. Rock and roll. We can hear them, but where are they? In the ship somewhere. Well, not necessarily. It is their ship. It is their ship. Well, not for much longer, anyway. I mean, I hate to sound greedy, but, you know, they, they did Mine. Kind of... <laughs> no, I wasn't going with that. Mine now. Oh, mine. I found it. Mine. Yep, you landed <laughs> on our planet. Mine. You now belong to the state of Australia. <laughs> Hello? Anyone inside? You need a flag. You need to put a flag in it. Do they have a flag? <laughs> yes, no flag, no country! No, no, no flag, no country. That includes alien species as well. Invading the Earth, yeah. Uh -huh. You need a flag. Yeah, they need a flag. If they don't have a flag, you know, they, they don't have dominion. Clearly. Have they learned nothing from all these years spent watching us? <laughs> Clearly not. Well, do you have a flag? Do you have a flag? <laughs> Alright, so let me see. He needs to reload. He does. So run in here, look important, and reload your gun. Mm -hmm. Good job, Gangnam Style. Alright, he's all reloaded. Mm -hmm. Eventually. Okay, Table Lamp, it looks like you're going to be a part of this strike team. We'll call this strike team Ouch. <laughs> ouch my face, not the face. Strike, Please not the face. Strike, strike team, ouch my face. Who <laughs> has very peculiar specialties. <laughs> which only they have mastered. <laughs> okay. Yeah, we hear you big uglies. We know you're in there. Well, you're gonna be awful surprised when you realize there are two heavy troopers with laser machine guns waiting just outside. To say hello. Alright, what we definitely need to do is get people in position. So, uh, Donna, we're going to put you over here. Table lamp, naturally. Your position, up <laughs> front. We're actually going to have you just be on Overwatch for now, because goodness knows what you'll actually end up doing. Let's experiment. Well, actually, no. Let's actually hunker down. Because we're almost out of turns here for our characters. It might actually make more sense for them to take a moment and then go from there. Mr. Gangnam will back them up. Alright, and that guy, that, that looks explosive, so you should stay away from that. Yeah, but you should have people on Overwatch. Overwatch is good. Alright. Let's see what happens. They haven't opened their little light beam doors, but apparently they are very close. Alright, so I suppose if anybody's gonna storm, it might as well be table lamp. Let's open it up. Do we see anyone? No. 
Thankfully, opening doors is not considered an action, so we can do that and then actually see if we spot anyone. No. Hmm. How peculiar. Table lamp? Uh, shall we really do the table lamp thing? Well, first thing I think we should do is probably see if there's anyone in this area. Yeah. Wait, he can actually move that far? Yeah, it looks that way. Alright, well, I'm going to have him move that far and see if he spots anything on the way in. And if he does, he can just run out. Really, there's nothing over here. Hmm. Okay, apparently it's safer than we thought. Alright, let's get ready for even... Maybe we should check over there. Um... No, we're not hearing them from that uh -huh. direction. So, Mr. Gangnam Style, uh, we actually could have him guard the back door. Not a bad idea. Alright, good job, Mr. No, what are you gonna revive? <laughs> gonna revive your hip-hop song. Okay, <laughs> so, let me see, Miss Sniper. Yeah. Go find yourself a comfy corner. Try to look important. There you go. That guy. Mm -hmm. Well, clearly somebody has to help that guy. Yeah, he's got it. He knows mm -hmm. the guy. Mm-hmm. He, he, he knows what has to be done. Uh, Guzman. Um, let's see, is there another side to this door we can hide behind? Well, apparently there is. Aliens are like, where is everyone? I don't hear anything. They're about, they're about right. to get a... All right, table lamp, pop that door. Table lamp is over oh. here, actually. Why is he over there? Uh, he got he got preoccupied with other matters. We're There's just a bar that way. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Okay, so let's uh, let's have Moose knock on the door. Hello. Hi. Uh, oh boy, we've got two psychic aliens, and they just apparently just ran out in the middle. Well, that that seems like kind of a panicky thing to do. Um, how about you just turn around and shoot him? Oh, hi. We're, we're right here, actually. Hmm. Uh, and just in case you, you were wondering, we're going to do that again. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Ma Good maybe, job. Maybe your instincts to run out in the middle were not... Um, the best idea. Yeah, unfortunately. All right, we don't want to blow anything up when it comes to the flight computers, so we have to be careful how we engage these guys. Uh, maybe we could have that guy... Have we taken this away? I think so. Right? Yes, we have. That's We're building the psych lab, remember? Right. We couldn't build the psionics lab until we captured one of them. Hi there. Zam. One damage. Oh, that's a fluke of the dice. All right, so we're going to have you run over here, Guzman. Try not to kill your buddy in the crossfire. I don't think that actually works, but we'll find out. There you go. Four damage. Goodness, this one just doesn't want to die. Um... I don't know how she can do this without blowing up that computer, because we don't really want to do that. What about you, Gangnam Style? Can you run over there and hopefully not shoot the computer? Doesn't look like it, actually. Um, Alright, well then I guess she'll just kind of run all the way here, and then see if that is actually... No, it's a terrible odds. Switch to your pistol. Let's see, does that give you better odds? Yep. Fantastic odds! Whack him! Bam! One damage! <laughs> it's the thought that counts. Um, <laughs> Alright, screw it. Screw this computer. I don't want him taking mind control over my buddies. Blast them! Man, this guy just doesn't want to die. Well, what's he gonna do? He's surrounded by five characters now. Oh. He's going to ineffectually shoot at that guy. Nice. That's, your, that's what you're gonna do? You're gonna ineffectually shoot at that guy. Mm -hmm. well, that's that, your turn now. that is that is so ridiculous. I am actually gonna just try to capture him, hmm. just out of spite. I know we already had one of these guys, but really, screw it. This is just dumb. We need to study your stupidity. <laughs> yeah. Oh man, the stun failed. Yeah, just shoot him in the face. Well, that guy does not appreciate being shot, sir. Yeah. That'll do it. All right, 12 enemies killed, and we didn't lose anyone. Woo! Hooray! Yay, high five. Progress. I feel like we're almost a somewhat professional, semi-legitimate kind of operation here. We're getting there. Yeah. We need some more satellites. I mean, it's not like we're based in Nigeria or anything and sending out emails about princes. 
that inadvertently deposited their funds in your bank account. No, no, you're somehow related to them. Ah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, nice. Wow, okay, lots of promotions. Table Lamp is now Major Table Lamp. Awesome. Corporal Jackson is now Sergeant Jackson. And Mr. Moose is now Captain Moose. All right, well, she can either get Gunslinger, which gives her two more damage with pistols, or Damn Good Ground, which gives her aim and defense bonuses when fighting enemies at lower elevation. Hmm. Hmm, so situational and more or more backup damage. Yeah, but she doesn't really use the pistol that much. She did use it this time. That's true. And she gets too close. Yeah. Uh, but then again, since most maps do have some deviation in elevation, it might make sense to just give her this and always try to put her on the high ground. Yeah. Okay, let's go with that. Alright, Major Table Lamp automatically gets extra conditioning. Confers bonus health based on which type of armor is equipped. Heavier armor increases his bonus. Nice. So Table Lamp's getting tougher because, hell, if shooting him didn't work the first time, it's less likely to work the second time. <laughs> Alright, Grenadier will allow him to carry two grenades in an in inventory slot if he wants to use that instead of the little bonus extra health armor. Or Danger Zone which means it increases the area of effect of suppression, which he doesn't have, and all rocket attacks by two tiles. Oh, but he does use rockets. He does use rockets. He, he only use sometimes grenades. uses grenades. He does use rockets. I think making the rockets bigger is a good idea. Okay, we'll go with bigger rockets. Well done. All right, and we get to autopsy a berserker. We got Sectoid Commander, Floater, Thinman, Muton, Berserker Corpse, Lyrium, oh, Alien know. Alloys, Weapon Fragments, UFO Flight Computers, and Power Sources. Mm -hmm. And I don't think we even broke any equipment this time, which is actually an achievement for us. Yeah. Alright, and we cannot complete these sales until we actually have the money to manufacture laser rifles to sell them. Let's see, do we have any junk that we absolutely do not need under any circumstances? It doesn't look I like it. So. This is actually one of the unfortunate side effects of actually being competent in our operations is that we don't have spare junk to sell. Okay, um, well, what were we, uh, research. We were going to very quickly autopsy this berserker. Mm -hmm. The body of this creature still remains warm to the touch several, after, several hours after being terminated. Chemical analysis of the alien's tissue will likely provide insights into this strange phenomenon. The men are calling this beast the Berserker, although it shares the same structure as the Muton, for reasons yet unknown to us. The Berserker seems to be consumed by bloodlust with little regard for its own safety. Thank you. Okay, although similar to the previously catalogued Muton species, this particular specimen is different. Our troops have taken calling this beast the Berserker based on its uncharacteristically aggressive tactics in the field. Despite sharing the same physiological structure of the other mutants, for reasons yet unknown to us, the Berserker seems to be consumed by bloodlust, charging into combat with little regard for its own safety. Current theories as to the cause of this behavior have led us to begin investigating possible genetic manipulation of the subject's endocrine glands, or in this case, the equivalent glands that appear to secrete androgenic hormones. If the aliens enlarged or modified the action of these glands, it could explain the Berserker's outbursts. Specifics on this creature's ability to combat should be available when using the unit analysis view on another specimen of the same type in the field. It also allows us to make combat stims. This powerful stimulant cocktail derived from a chemical found in the glands of a muton berserker provides a temporary boost to several of our soldiers' vital statistics. It can build them, basically to give them super steroids. Well, let's continue our normal research project. And, um, I suppose we, because the center don't really have money yet, we can continue scanning. Yeah. Now, we have plasma rifles! Excellent. Although we continue to gain a better understanding of the alien plasma weapons we recover from each passing day, adapting the technology is about one aspect of the process involved in designing these weapons. We must also ensure that the armaments we develop are suitable to the firing positions our troops are accustomed to. If the weapon doesn't conform to human ergonomic standards, our troops certainly won't be able to fire it effectively. As a result of our efforts to reduce the weapon's weight, we've noticed a substantial improvement in the overall accuracy of this rifle. In addition to manufacturing these new lightweight plasma rifles, we can also apply this approach to modify any plasma rifles captured in the field. Sweet. So wait, did we have an order for laser rifles? Because we swapped these. Oh, we don't. We didn't make. Plasma's it. better. Yeah, and we can actually it. research plasma cannons now, which okay. is a upgrade for our ships. 
Yes, we should get that, but we didn't actually make them yet, so never mind, because we don't have money to make it. Begin project. So we'll have plasma cannons very soon for our ships. Once we have money. And yeah. aren't we working on the next kind of ship? Or did we already do that? I don't know. Let's check in the research lab. Uh, pretty sure we did. I don't know. I don't think we've made any yet, though. Uh, let's review our research. Um, UFO technology. Yeah, we did research the, okay. the crafts. But I don't think we actually made any because I think they're awful expensive. Mm -hmm. You ship list. Yeah, we've got a raven in each area. So, oh, hit the order button and see how much it costs for now. Oh, that's for an interceptor, though. That's not what we're looking for. Oh, okay. Hmm. Oh, well. Let's continue scanning. It's not like we can do anything about it right now, anyway. Hey! Oh, good. Let's go launch that, uh, settlement. Sign new projects. Well, by projects, I mean let's go to the Situation Room and throw some satellites at Egypt. You need to hit the launch button. Launch satellite, Egypt. 80 uh, credits per month, more scientists. Mm -hmm. Cool. Launch satellite. Go. Alright, Egypt's happy. Canada, Argentina, and Nigeria are not in panic mode right now. I think we should save our last satellite for the time being. And if somebody gets... Do we have one? Oh, we do have one. Okay. Yeah, and if something bad goes and somebody really needs help, yeah. We can deploy it as necessary. Sound good? Okay. Alright, very good. Alright, so let's continue scanning, see if anything interesting pops up. Plasma cannon created. Alright. So we continually started to even the odds for our pilots facing the alien craft in combat. One of our most important developments was the research engineering of this plasma-based weapon. I believe the plasma cannon is now ready for general fabrication and engineering. I'm confident our pilots will appreciate the additional firepower. Basically shoots superheated plasma. So that's cool. Uh -huh. Alright, and now we can either do plasma pistol, six days. Plasma rifle, seven yeah, days. Rifle. Uh, light rifle. This is a more powerful version of it. Yeah. Ghost armor, which allows people to cloak. Archangel armor, which allows people to fly. And our EMP cannon, which is um, electromagnetic Ooh. pulse, it's basically a super cannon for our ships. That would just shut down all their circuitry. Maybe that's a good idea. Disabling electronic systems without destroying them. They're, that's slow, that's slow, and that's slow. Plasma pistol and plasma rifle are like twice as fast. I said the rifle. You said we should do the rifle? Yeah, we don't use pistols that much. So. Alright, so we'll begin the plasma rifle research. Seems like our research efforts are going quite well, actually. Mm -hmm. Alright, our satellite will be operational over Egypt in two days. We'll have another satellite uplink, the psionic lab, and better bed kits in six days. Nice. Things are going rather well. Alright, satellite's there. And, yeah, everything is getting done here. Our med kits now heal six instead of four. Which is very good. Mm -hmm. We're about to get a satellite uplink and a psionics lab. Well done. I don't think we have money to construct. Oh. Yep. And our psionics lab. Nice. Creepy. What does it do? We got a rebate. 14 credits, one alloy, and one lyrium. Oh. And one more day for a plasma rifle. They're actually asking for sectoid corpses, eight of them. Well, we only have two, so you're out of luck. Uh, okay, assign your research because the plasma rifles are done. We can also convert plasma rifles we find into human usable plasma rifles. This basically says they're awesome. <laughs> okay, uh, now new research. We actually don't, don't have, have the weapon, weapon fragments right? necessary to continue researching all these I think plasma weapons. I should weapons. start researching the EMP cannon. Ghost, Archangel Armor, EMP cannon. You think we should go with the EMP cannon? Yeah. Alright. EMP cannon begun. So we actually did make some money now. Uh, question is, is that actually going to be enough for us to make anything that we would need? Let's see. Uh, no, got scopes, we got lots of med kits. We don't have the resources to actually build any plasma stuff. 
Ooh, wow, they're expensive. Plasma guns cost a lot of money. We can also make chitin plating from the chrysalids. Yeah. What this does is it actually, it's an even better form of the nanofiber vest. Yeah, we don't have money for it. Yeah, I know, I'm just saying offhand. All right, we can also, if we have the money for it, we can build Titan armor, which would also be awesome. Yeah. We can, we actually do have the technology to build firestorms, but like everything else, we're short of money. Always short of money. What about a UFO tracking boost? Uh, well, the money is the big restrictor right now. Well, Let's look at our capacity. We have one satellite we can deploy, and we have 12 in capacity, so we should order more satellites. Yeah. Uh, that we is, have money for a satellite. Yeah, we do. And that is generally the priority, is always invest in satellites first. Mm -hmm. Alright, I think we can buy one. Yeah. Okay. And we're just probably going to have to wait till next month, which will be in 17 days. Yeah, it's Scanning. Long. Quest from Asia is going to expire. Ho oh, ho! We have a UFO just landing smack dab in the middle of India. How are we not shooting these things down? Well, that's the thing. If we didn't have the satellite there to spot him... We wouldn't even know. We wouldn't even know he was there. Mm. Alright, so let's see. Uh, people are still... Nobody's a colonel here yet, so I'd say this loadout's probably okay, right? Yeah, sure. Alright. Let's get some of our senior officers even more experienced. Oh, I know what we forgot to do the before we left. We for, yeah, you can assign up to three soldiers at once to basically get tested in the psionics lab for a number of days. And uh, it, they're basically trying to see whether they have psionic potential. All right. So here we are, all the way in India. Wow, I gotta say, it looks rather nice in this part of the country. Mm -hmm. We're on the east coast, it looks like. I can't wait to go to India. Well, we can definitely tell you that this is a big ship. Yeah. Look at how big that is. What are is. all those pod things? I, I don't know. What are they? Wait a minute. Hmm? Donna Jackson's name is Hex? That's new. Oh, yeah. She, she just became a sergeant. Yeah. No, we need a better nickname. Hex is lame. We gotta come up with something way better. We're open to suggestions. Yeah, hey, if anyone wants to think up a nickname for our African-American sniper, Donna Jackson. Um, she's African-American? Yeah, she is. Pretty sure that's the butch white girl. Uh, nope. That's Donna Jackson, dear. Then she's got blonde hair that's dyed. Uh-huh. Pretty sure you're talking about the butch white girl. Nope. Hey. Nope. Table lamp. If you want a nickname for Donna Jackson, so give us a recommendation. Right now, we all we have is Hex. That, frankly, I find That's insufficient. Terrible. We need to come up with something much better. Something that will satisfy everyone's needs. I don't even know what that means. All right, so let's <laughs> continue moving into possession, everyone. Quickly, 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 including you, that guy. Guess what, that guy? You're gonna outcompete Table Lamp there. Move all the way to the front. Now well, this is surprising. Whoa! Floaters! What a rocket would take care of that. Oh, and we've got ourselves a giant machine and just little drones. Two rockets would take care of that. Let's see, Cyber Disc, that's what the things are called. Yeah, you guys are making quite a presentation of yourself. Mm -hmm. No doubt about it. I think you need to rocket the cyber disk. That would be good. I'm trying to think. We don't want people to bunch up at all. Hey, wait a minute. This yeah. actually might be the perfect opportunity to get all three of these guys. Yeah. All right, right there. That that would definitely get all three, and it's four damage, so that's exactly what we need. You may be able to get a drone if you place it back. You really think so? Wow. Well, you know, yeah. I think you might be right. 
We All right. Yeah. Go for the sniper shot, Moose. Do it. Let them see what you can do with your new expanded radius rockets. Mm -hmm. Boom! Yeah, you, you hit the drone, too. And apparently get double damage against the drone is also... Nice. Well, that solved that problem. No floater for to do, please. These oh. aliens do not seem to appreciate the... Rockets. Well, no, just the general silliness of cloud, uh, crowding. Mm -hmm. They don't seem to really appreciate just how terrible an idea that actually is. Yeah, he doesn't have a good shot. No, he doesn't, because he has a shotgun. What about this guy? He actually has a decent shot. Go ahead there, Ricardo. There you go. Oh, well. One damage. Something. You're helping. All right, Guzman, he needs to get somewhere else. Well, he's going to just provide cover for this time. Um, let's see. We're going to move Jackson up into heavy cover. Put her on Overwatch as well, because no doubt that thing's about to come forward. All right, table lamp. Um, well, let's let's have you do what you do. Are you let's sure that's a good idea with the cyber does? Oh, uh, he'll be fine. All right, not, uh, 64 and 72. I want to get rid of the drone because I don't want that thing healing it. There we go. Nice. Good job. Mhm. Mm All right, so the drone's been dealt with. Now Gangnam Style can run up and hopefully take a shot at the Cyber Disc. Sure enough, he's got one. 48%. Not great. Yeah. Hey, but he still lands a 5 damage hit. Now what's Big Bad Cyber Disc gonna do? They're falling back! He's gonna run away! What a chicken! I am really disappointed in the Cyber Disc. It is almost as if it was somewhat intimidated by the fact that, you know, they took well, over 90% losses within the first round. Rockets. Could this be the ship responsible for the attacks taking place during the alien abductions? Really? Maybe. Yeah, it is big. It does have pods. It, it does have pods. We remember there being pods in the enemy base as well. Alright, everybody. Well, it's time to go chase. Um, just run over that way as quickly as you can. <laughs> He'll be fine. <laughs> yeah, just kind of waddle up there, little John. That's Wait, good. he had a shot on somebody. Oh, but he was out of movement oh. points, so... He well, can't do anything just, else about that. Anybody there. <coughs> quickly, run! Run, run, run! Oh, wait, he actually has a shot. Oh, wait, this is Table Lamp again. Yeah. Table Lamp, <coughs> you madman! Alright, well, let's... He's not going to let this thing go. He's gonna run and gun it, because he's a madman like that. It's a cyber so it has a lot of health still. I don't care, he's got like a freaking laser shotgun. You know what he thinks about those things? Ooh. He thinks he's gonna find more with his face. Yep, sounds about right. That's what he's gonna do. And he is gonna have to find some magical way to survive. Good luck, Table Lamp. Yeah. Hopefully one damage. One damage. Man, this is a this is an exciting new challenge for Table Lamp. This one, this this might be good. Mm -hmm. All right, let's uh, let's. Have <laughs> this is not this is gonna be bad. Come on, Moose. Table Lamp might be able to survive this one. Probably not. Yeah, I think you need a medic to stand next to him. Uh oh. Oh my God, he missed. Oh. Point blank, no less. Wow. Here comes the big laser. Uh oh, that's that looks bad. Oh, oh wait. Cool. Oh, he threw a grenade at us. Oh. Arg! Five damage! Okay. To but two guys. The table lamp's okay. Yeah, but, you know, that's ten total damage to the team. Yeah. We didn't... Yeah. I, I really expected him to be dead. Yeah. I, I mean, I'm not, I'm not trying to be mean or anything, but... <laughs> table lamp is amazing that way. Yeah. I think you need to find new cover. Uh, yeah, table lamp, you might want to consider just moving around the corner. Yeah. Just for the time being. And maybe shooting this thing in the face. Alright, six damage. That's an improvement. Mm -hmm. Alright, very good. Um, hmm. If we stay here, it might throw another grenade. Which we don't want. But these guys are both hurt. Yeah. And we don't want them to be exposed. I think we just need to lay down the firepower right now. I think you need to move at least one of them up to the other side. I'm going to see if our sniper has a shot. Nope. Oh, man, Jackson, what are you doing to me? Do you have cover here? No. no. You have cover anywhere? Yeah. No. Well, there. yes, but then he has to move. 
All right, take your best shot. That's looking good. Oh yeah. Okay, I'm fairly certain she's just tan. Okay. That she is not our favorite African American. Okay, our favorite tan sniper with the obviously dyed blonde hair, or yeah. someone that just spends all their time in a tanning booth. Oh uh, yeah. Or at the beach. Yeah, I was gonna say. I wonder if we can actually fire the rocket through. I don't think so. That hole in the wall. I, I really wouldn't. I remember what happened last time and it like hit the ceiling and exploded. Yeah, okay. Maybe yeah. that's not the best idea. Alright, well we got the, the biggest problem out of, out of the way. I'm going to actually say this guy is going to move off to the right and spray himself with some medicine. Good idea. Good job, Gangnam. Got to keep your hits going. Oh crap, that actually wasted one health. Oh well. Not a huge deal. It's one. It's better than, you know. You know what? Uh, fine. I'll have that guy do... It, it was both our medics, interestingly mm -hmm. enough. They'll be fine. Yeah. So, make yourself feel better. Mm -hmm. Good job, team. You're thinking like the smart guys. Uh, well, we could... Well, There's we can't problem. fire the rocket. Wait, maybe this guy has a better shot. Because he is kind of lined up with the hallway. Uh, no, he's really not. No, he's uh, too far away. And he's really diagonal to the hallway. And there's really no more cover anymore. Nope. Okay, we're going to have you run way over there. Yeah. Whee! And then there's Moose. Yeah, he's Who actually has a shot at something. Yeah. Oh, wow, that thing. Okay, we'll do it, Moose. Hey, 10 damage. Nice. Sexy. Can you do it again? No. But you got a quick sneak shot in. Well, looks like there's going to be some returning fire, though. Yeah, I think so Six so damage. All right, the little mech bots are probably going to start healing their little friend there. How much? Three health. Oh, okay, so I'm six sure of that damage seven. just gets negated. Yeah. Alright, we obviously need to put the pressure on this this sucker. I kind of wish he had grenades right now, but he doesn't. And it's kind of a major risk to get closer. But, so we'll just take a shot at the big boy. Whoa! 13 damage, critical hit. Nice! It blew up, too. Well done, Table Lamp. Well done. High five. He's got nothing to worry about. How does this guy survive? I just don't understand what he does. Drunk. Th th but then he would get hurt eventually. Yeah, but he'd be oh, like you don't you don't get as hurt when you're drunk. This is why. Like, I understand because your yeah. body's more relaxed and everything, but th it's just insane. The probability required. Yeah, no. This guy should be dead by now. Yeah, but you hear about all these drunk driving accidents where like the driver, you know, is alive and cuts and bruises, and they end up, like, killing five people, you know? Well, you know, that's kind of a depressing subject. Well, matter. it is, but my point <laughs> is, these things do happen in real life. Okay, so. yeah. Well, except for the aliens. Yeah. At least that's Obviously. what that's what the CIA wants you to believe. Would it be the CIA? Oh, I'm sure, you know, maybe it's the NSA, or the CIA, or the... FBI. FBI, or the... Because the CIA is more, like, international. Well, obviously, I think alien and visiting Earth would be... Yeah, that's, that's a problem. Aliens visiting Earth would be a fairly international affair, I think. He is the only guy in that room. Yeah, he is, but he's okay. He can go hide over here and, you know, look important. You ain't gonna get me! So long, sucker! They still got a great chance to shoot it. Yeah. Seven damage. Well done, sir. Well done. Um, can he actually shoot up at the drones? He can. Kind of. Well, if the wall isn't there, it'll be easier to shoot it. Mm -hmm. Unless the wreckage actually blocks his shot. Well, doesn't he feel silly? Oh, wait. He can try shooting at it again. Darn. No. Well, you know, he tried. Uh, we definitely have to get Miss Sniper over here to try to take a... That's actually cover. Uh, well, every little bit counts right now. I don't think a headshot really means anything against this thing, but maybe it'll still work as a critical hit. Hold on. 
Four damage, not bad. Okay, now we need to get Table Lamp over here. Uh, you know what? I, I don't think he needs cover. Hmm. After what we've seen, clearly Table Lamp doesn't He's require fine. cover at all. In fact, he, you know, he doesn't have any ammunition and shotgun, screw it, he'll just switch to his pistol and shoot no, it with that. I don't think it'll be enough. He's a maniac like that. This guy just does not care. Yeah, he'll, he'll be singing the praises. Um, well, we're going to have to bring up some flanking fire from the top, it looks like, if we're going to deal with this, this little uh, cyber disc before it hurts people. So, over the top! Nice. Now, he is going to be exposed to the two drones, but their weapons are not very effective. And he's also taking cover behind a flaming wreck, which is also kind of cool. Yeah. So, Moose there gets total cool points. Alright, what are the little drones? They're going to try shooting him. Bam! Three damage. And what about number two? They're going to shot at him. Bam! One damage. Yeah, that's fine. We don't care about your weenie guns. In fact, screw it. You know what? Guzman just doesn't care. He's just going to keep shooting through that wall until <laughs> he hits what he's after. Nice job. That's how little John does it. Mm -hmm. Don't you forget it, aliens. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. Miss Jackson, can you actually run up here and take a shot around the corner? No. Nope. Well, I need to reload really then. Alright, Table Lamp. Table Lamp needs to reload his other weapon. No, he doesn't. He's Table Lamp. He's fine. Alright, fine. I'll have him switch and reload. <laughs> Thank you. Oh, crap. I didn't tell I didn't mean to tell Moose to reload. Uh, uh, crap. Oh, okay. Well, can you open the door? No. 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 All right. Well, guess what? You're gonna have to be the guy who runs in here and like shoots this thing from like, or just jump over the ledge. That also works. Wait, how is it repugnant? We put aliens we capture in glasses too. Mm -hmm. Where is she coming from, being all judgy like this? No one. Goodness. All right, does anyone have a turn left? No? Okay. <laughs> here, go run back and cover back up here where we thought we were sending you. Uh, I, I, no, or, or just don't do anything. What about that guy? Can that guy save the day? Uh, I don't, I don't, I don't think he can. No. All right, that guy. Go join Table Lamp. You'll get there eventually. Uh, <laughs> whatever. Just reload. It, it just doesn't even matter at this point. <laughs> uh, if he's gonna try to shoot it, probably does a goose or something, and we'll just miss. It doesn't even matter. Your guns do not conserve us. Uh, I needed to be on the upper level here in order yeah. for that to work. So, you know, they can snuggle like that. Because it's important to them. It's healthy for their relationship. <laughs> Hey, take a trick shot! Over the shoulder of your buddy! Or don't. I'm pretty sure we just wrecked something important in there. Problem. Oops. Blew up one of the tanks. Oops. Now, excuse me! Uh, 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 well, I, I don't want a running gun. I, I want to shoot it. Uh, son of a... Hug her down. You did already move. Hug her down. Just hug her down, dare you! I don't know why he's not hungry right now. Fine, run and gun. Can you run and gun? No. Did it, did it break again? Uh, I don't think so. I think he's just kind of confused as to what he can do. Uh, we're just going to have you run over here. Okay. Good job. Good job, sir. Which one was that one? Uh, that was table lamp. Yeah, he's a little drunk. Yeah, yeah he just kind of looked yeah. at the little bot with this perplexed look on his face. Was like, what am I supposed to do? Oh, looks like a perfectly friendly service droid to me. These are not the droids you're looking for. Uh-oh, and that holding tank is on fire. Okay, that person is definitely not being rescued. Sorry! <laughs> I didn't know we were rescuing people. Uh, well, I, I don't think we are, but no, we try to at least... Why is he, like, outside now? Because, uh, he, he uh, he's also somewhat drunk. This was not the best time for us to go on a mission. Let's just put it that way. We're celebrating. Mm-hmm. All right. Uh, we're pretty sure there are aliens somewhere nearby here. Somewhere important. 
like possibly by this doorway that we're moving up towards. It's kind of funny because it landed intact too, but we are we're not doing a good job keeping this place in decent shape. No. But you know that's okay, right? That's not a big deal, is it? It's only one tank. Yeah. We don't even know how to use them anyway. No, of course not. It, that's probably how we'd have to open them in the first place. Yeah, you moved that guy outside this time. Yeah, I, I'm He's trying to I'm trying to get them Gangnam Style. I know you're confused right now, but we need you to come back in here. I'm sure you had fun dancing out in the woods, just mm. like you you love to do, but now it's time to be serious. Oh, excuse me. Alright, I'm going to have him go on Overwatch. Table Lamp, recovering from his alcohol-induced mm. uh, madness, confusion. confusion, madness, hysteria, I, I don't even know. M Moose, you should probably be a little closer to the action, considering you are heavy. Mm -hmm. That actually might be a good spot behind that ledge for uh, Miss Jackson here. Shall we call her Janet? Oh! <laughs> no, that would be lame. Alright, let's open the door. Hi, is anyone here? Yes. Um, yes. That's a reasonable thing to talk about, uh, Dr. Shen. Yeah, I mean, they did. They, uh, they're not up anymore. They haven't been particularly friendly about their research methods. Uh, we should definitely try to uh, shredder them, because that would really make them have an awful day. Yeah. This sure will actually get to and not hit our buddy at the same time. Right. And it's not a far shot, so he's bound to hit it. Who gives a crap about not destroying the local equipment? Yeah, that play computer's gone. Yeah, I don't... I, we don't care about that. We need extra money anyway, so you know what? It's fine. Everything is fine. And Oh wait, you already took your turn. What about you there, buddy? You got any good shots? Shots that'll win the day for us? Mm. Not really. So we're gonna have to move you such that you can do that. In fact, uh... Man, I wish there was a better place he could hide. Uh, how about here? Yeah. Or, yeah, that actually provides him cover from two angles. And now he's got flank shots on two suckers. I'm going to try to get the one that's wounded. Well, no. you definitely slightly wounded him. Good effort. Mm-hmm. I think that's an A for effort right there. Yeah, we just have to rush this room and take them out before they can do anything horrible. That's really all the logic there is to this point. Considering that if all these guys, three aliens, try to focus on mind control, they could turn half our squad against us. And frankly, that is just, that is not kosher. Uh, yeah, please shoot him. Thank you. Alright, Miss Jackson. Can you miss shoot someone? Uh, maybe from here? Odds do not look fan- Oh, yeah, you can! Go for the headshot! Right in his humongous cranium. That'll do it. Good job. Alright, and here we have Table Lamp. Well, guess what, Table Lamp? If all you know how to do is run and gun... Oh, I know why it wasn't working. It's because he doesn't have a shotgun out. Oh. Or he does. I'm, I'm confused what, what is going on with Table Lamp here. I'm going to try to move Table Lamp right in front of this thing. Table Lamp, can you shoot it? No. Can you stun it? You have terrible odds. Can you stand there looking silly? I'm going to say yes. This is really weird. Maybe it needs to be reloaded. Maybe there's a reloading glitch? I have no idea. All I know is the table lamp is going to take a break. Yeah, I think you should try to reload next time. I think we're going to shoot him. That's what no, we're going to do. No, with table lamp here. Reload with table lamp. Oh, that just sounds so conventional. All right, well, you're surrounded by marine, you know, space marine dudes. Oh, that hurt a little bit. Four damage? Oh, come on. This guy could have tried so much harder. I'm just going to try to capture him out of spite. Table lamp style. Come on, stun him. 70%. The odds are in our favor. See, he can't even use his normal. I don't know stun. What's going on with yeah, him. this is really weird. Can he try to grapple something? Oh, just, just, you know, just, no. Yeah, I don't care. It's just a glitch. Just shoot him. There we go. Yeah, we already got one of these guys. Alright, well, it's over. All objectives complete. 
So apparently this was a pretty major ship. Mm -hmm. So let's see what this reveals in terms of the story. Set down in India of all places. Interesting. Yes, we're landing. All right, so Lieutenant Guzman is now Captain Little John. Donna is now a lieutenant, still needs a better nickname. Mm -hmm. Gangnam is now also a captain. Well done. We can give him dense smoke, increased area of effect, and further increases unit defense by 20, or combat drugs. The smoke contains stimulants that grant more will and higher critical tr strike chance for anything, anybody mm -hmm. in the cloud. So what would you say is more Gangnam, defense or offense? I don't know. I kind of like the idea of the, the stims. Okay. Alright, he gets everybody so excited with his magic dancing drugs. Hmm. Alright, we can give uh, Donna here disabling shot, which allows the sniper to fire a shot that causes the target's main weapon to malfunction. The target may use reload to fix the weapon. The shot cannot inflict a critical hit. Two turn cooldown. So anything that has a, oop, consider, anything that has a, or we can give her the battle scanner, which allows her to throw the scanner, which scans for two turns. Mm -hmm. So increased division or something to make enemies with weapons malfunction. That's not going to be much use against psionic enemies or uh, berserkers, but it'll be helpful against mutons, floaters, anything that uses guns. Whatever. I mean, we went with the scanner for the last one, so. All right, so let's just go with disabling shot for her, yeah. just for variety's sake. And little John, two grenades or bigger rockets? Bigger rockets. You always we go don't for bigger use rockets. Grenades. I know it's a shame though, because big rocket uh, grenades are fun. All right, so we have corpses, floater corpses, drones, lyrium, alloys, weapon fragments, stasis tanks. We do have some broken stuff that we can sell. Hooray! <laughs> Including alien surgery. That's awkward. Yeah. All right, well, let's go to the search. Wait, there was a request for something. Do we have it now? Uh, oh, no. No. One is for laser rifles. Which we still don't have. No. And one is for sectoid corpses. I thought we just got one. No, those are the commanders. Oh, okay. So, we do have some broken stuff that we can actually sell. Fantastic. Totally worth it. Okay. And all this other stuff is actually, wait a minute, alien surgery. The item has no research benefit and can be sold freely. Okay, so it's basically just a pod. That's handy. All right, uh, this stuff, oh, alien stasis tank, no research benefit, can be sold freely. Cool. All right, free income. And we have all this other stuff, which is useful in various capacities. All right, apparently Central is getting tired. Mm -hmm. Let's, uh, one thing that we actually forgot to do is to go to engineering. The psionics lab. The psionics lab, yes, but where is it? I thought it was finished. It is. So maybe we just have to go to facility. Psionics lab is there. Thermal generator is also up, mm -hmm. which is excellent. We should consider expanding, considering we have all, so much extra power. We could put in more workshops, more satellite uplinks. We already have a surplus, surplus, so we probably need to build a lot more satellites. Yeah. So let's go with another workshop. We don't have it. Yeah, we do. Right there. We don't have enough for power, do we? Oh, it's going to cost us uh, quite a bit of money to actually build it. Yeah. We have plenty of power. It's not free right now, though. Yeah, we have the power free to do it. Oh, Look, okay. workshop. It's only three power. It's going to cost us most of the money we just got, though. Oh, okay. Uh, hmm. Do you want to do that? Okay. That's what you want to do. But here, that's the thing. I'm kind of conflicted as to what to do there. A bit conflicted indeed. Let's see. Council report is in, in 13 days. We have a request from Asia and the UPK. We're train people to sign, actually. Yeah, the question is, how do we actually barracks, do that? Maybe? Let's see if it's in the barracks. There we go. Visit the Psy Labs. We can now submit our soldiers for testing within the Psy Lab. Once we have a complete report, I notify you with the results. Our current research implies a strong link between a candidate's willpower and their psionic potential. We're hoping that one or more of our existing soldiers will meet the necessary requirements. Well, easy to see who we're going to test. 
Yeah. Our three colonels. Badass. Nyako. Watch. And Mr. Nice. Should we Nyako? Who knows? Alright, so they're going to spend ten days getting tested. Okay. Alright, in terms of uh, OCS, maybe there's something new we could get? Nothing we can afford. Larger will bonus each time they're promoted. That's only good for newbies. Ah, uh, don't die on me. This makes it less likely for veterans to actually uh, die. They'll get critically wounded instead. And any new soldiers, if we decide to get more, are automatically promoted to the squatty rank. Okay, well that's neat, I suppose. But uh, in terms of the Situation Room, I think things are actually pretty stable right now. Yeah. Only Canada, Argentina, and Nigeria are at three, which is not unmanageable. We can't fulfill any of the requests. Mm, maybe we should take a break. I suppose that would be a decent thing to do. We've made some pretty good progress. We have some money. The Council report will be done in a few days. We have plenty of room to expand our facility. Quite a bit, actually. We could put in more workshops. Uh, we could uh, probably, I don't know, maybe even remove these power generators if we can get another thermal generator going here. Continue with our satellite uplinks, but I think right now we have more uplink capacity than we do satellites. I mean, uh, gosh, yeah. we're, we ordered like two satellites, right? I think one more. One more, and we also have one at the ready in case yeah. we need it. Sure. But uh, not, uh, something to consider, though, is that we'll actually get more money when the next month rolls over if we actually send one of our satellites out. So if you have to pick between Canada, Argentina, and Nigeria, what do you want to protect them over? Canada? Um, Canada? Well, if we get Nigeria, we get the all-in bonus, which I think is extra money? You want to protect Canada, don't you? Yeah. No matter what, it's always going to Canada. Canada! Alright, fine. <laughs> I see the Canadian bias here. Yeah, I imagine they would be upset that we're causing this much trouble. See, we're going to get that much more extra in the next month. Yeah. And then we have a capacity of four more satellites that we need. And I think we're only building one or two right now. Yeah, well, we have to wait... Satellites... 13 days. 17 days for... 13 days for money. For the council report. And the one satellite we have, we can build in... It's going to be 17 days. Yeah. Maybe we should actually see if we can build any neat weapons. Can we? Or armor, maybe, perhaps? We could build one Titan armor. Well, that's kind of awkward to just have one suit. I think we should actually buy two more satellites. Okay. All right, two more satellites. That's what we can afford, anyway. And I'd say this is probably a good time for us to take a break. I would agree. See you guys next time. Hope you had fun. We kicked some alien ass, took over yeah. their ship. I mean, it's not even really reasonable what we're doing to them at this point. They deserved it. Really? Did you not see those pods and tanks and surgeries and all this other crap? Yeah, but, like, it wasn't They that. started it. You're going to go with that they started it? <laughs> That's what you're going to go with? Yep. <laughs> that happened. All right. See you next time, guys. Bye-bye, everybody.